Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and this is the Tech News Update. We are Wednesday, February 7th, 2018. And today in our Tech News Update, we have Windows 10 Redstone 5 that might actually show up quite soon to insiders. <clears throat> there are some hints that uh, the first Redstone 5 build will show up maybe next week. Um, who knows? And it's also showing us that, you know what, we're getting close to uh, the release of Redstone 4 or what apparently would be called a Spring Creators Update. So if you're on the skip ahead, get ready. Uh, build is coming soon. Well, the New York Police Department, which actually had moved to Windows phones, is now getting Windows, uh, Windows, sorry, iPhone 7s to replace the Windows mobile platform. That is pretty much dead. And, uh, well, that was a uh, interesting adventure for the NYPD as they are moving now to iPhone 7s that I probably think will do maybe a little more than they wanted. Android version numbers. We have numbers of uh, Android and how popular they are. And uh, actually on one of the channels I have, which is the uh, Easy Computer Fixes channel, I'll be talking about this more in detail. So depending on the channel you are, there are different videos coming up today. So um, in general, version 8 or Android Oreo, the latest version, is on 1.1% of devices. Nougat is the most popular version. Version 7 is on 28.5% of devices. But very close behind is Marshmallow version 6 at 28.1%. And finally closing and quite still popular, version 5, Lollipop, 24.6% of devices. Well, yesterday was Safer Internet Day, and on the Safer Internet Day, they actually put a lot of emphasis on the fact that to stay safe, you got to do your part. And that is something that I always talk about here on this channel. The first line of defense, the first security is you. And so if you are careful, you're already there 99% of the security. And of course, um, having all the updates required. So I uh, hope you had a safer internet day yesterday. Progressive web apps are coming to Windows 10 uh, pretty much with the next release of Windows, Redstone 4. It seems that in some internal documentation, there's a lot of talk about how Microsoft is slowly moving away from universal Windows platform apps and will be pushing aggressively progressive web apps so that's uh, going to be something available and something happening with the next release of Windows 10, which is stated for the month of March. Well, the walking cat, that Twitter guy that actually, or girl, we don't actually know who he or she is, um, <clears throat> is always looking at what's happening at Microsoft and found a little picture that tells us that Microsoft Build Conference will happen May 7th to 9th 2018, which is kind of a day. It starts a day before Google I.O. So it's going to be like a mishmash of Google I.O. and Microsoft built in, you know, news for a couple of days. So uh, that's always the conference that's nice and interesting to watch because there's always that really cool, um, you know, keynote at the beginning, which is always interesting to see what's going to happen with Microsoft. Did you have your iPhone battery replaced in the past year or so and you paid full price of replacement? Well, take a look because Apple apparently is in thing that it might actually give you a rebate if you did so because of the, um, you know, battery throttling fiasco that's happening with Apple devices. So uh, hang on to uh, your receipt and... Um, check it out you might actually be having a rebate soon well these of course support scams are still going on strong um, strong enough that I will be probably updating a video today about security on this well there's a new version according to Kaspersky they have found out that one version that's going on right now on the web is actually targeting Google Chrome and it actually makes your Google Chrome browser kind of, you know, really freeze up by really rapidly saving tons and tons of files on your hard drive. 
So basically, of course, you can use a task manager to shut it down if it happens and never call any numbers that you see on your screen because these are all scan. And uh, we'll talk about it today a little more. I think it's, you know, from time to time, it's worth it to uh, kind of refresh everybody's memory on this. Opera 51 has been released and it uh, actually says, according to them, it's 38% faster than Firefox Quantum. So of course we'll be looking at the features, we'll be looking at uh, doing a small review of Opera 51 later today. So if you want to uh, learn what's new and um, hear my little comments on what I think of Opera, um, well check out my video and if you are using Opera, update to version 51. And are you one of those laptop or computer users that puts a tape or a little piece of paper over the webcam just to be on the safe side in case somebody would, you know, be using it to kind of watch your every moves? Well, HP is releasing a series of laptops that will have a little cover flip. So when you don't use a webcam, you can flip the cover over it. And uh, apparently it might become standard at some point on HP laptops. So why not? That's not a bad idea. So this was the Tech News Update for Wednesday, February 7th, 2018. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.